Yeah, but I'm not telling you. Bloody Harrison was still in denial. I said, no, you're a replicant. He said, no, I'm not. I said, you're a bloody replicant. What do you think you do that and shake and nod in agreement? What's the agreement about? We used to go on and on and on about that, but I'm friends with him now. I think I was probably the one that got Ryan involved. Because Ryan and my wet a general way, he said, when are you doing Blade Runner? I want to do that. So okay, it's happening. But then it was with, with became Denny Villeneuve, which I think is the, probably the best possible choice today. Um, and Harris had warned way back going, we're writing a screenplay with you, and you go, oh yeah, sure. But the screenplay he got, he said, this is one of the corrections, the best screenplay I've ever had. I said, thank you. I developed Blade Runner because they, obviously the first people ask when they bought the title and the franchise, Alcon, they said, is there a story? I said, of course it's a story. And there's always a story, but this is a very clear sequel. And through that, we went into a development process four years ago. Met with uh, the guy, I brought Hampton Fancher out the woodwork because I think he'd retired to New York. And he went, oh no, I said, no, you gotta come in. So we brought him in and we talked honestly for days. I'd been with Hampton, it was the longest time I've ever spent with a writer. I think it was almost five months with Hampton every day, realigning and growing the whole Blade Runner story into the world it was, because it started off as a play within a room, and it grew to what it was, because my frustration was, if you've got a world which literally constitutes the feasibility of a replicant or, you know, creation, um, you better justify it outside, you better believe the exterior, so I want to see the exterior. That's how it grew. And that gave me, in London with Hampton, a very nice 100 page, 100 pages, a novella, which told the whole story, A to Z, but then it wasn't a screenplay, and I had to then bring in Michael Green, a very good writer, and who then brought it into screenplay form with some changes and evolutions and things like that. But that was fundamental. That's about a three and a half year process. I'm very steeped in the process of the film.